discussion for today we we really thought that uh, we wanted to talk about what communities are um, and in this digital world uh, how communities have really come together and help keep people sane uh, and we want to begin by talking about by sheeples you know uh, because sheeples is a community yeah uh, we are like eight episodes too late into this but <laughs> yeah like this should have been our starter why sheeples came into existence yeah. kind of uh, podcast but we thought uh, better late than never we we really wanted to talk yeah. about how sheeples is a safe space is a community um, mm-hmm. and how what we're really trying to do is you know because in its sense the community is it's often a, a a group of like minded people um people who usually are homogeneous who who think alike um so i mean there's a good chance that if you're listening to us you're probably very similar to somebody who's 10000 kilometers away who's also listening to that and who's also similar to the two of us right now talking and something about our voice something about the things we talk something about our bad jokes something about <laughs> our usernames something about our whole approach really resonates with yeah also and... also the thing here i i i really like this like um we just wanted to do this because and this is something we started off i think two months ago we 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 were just sitting in my room actually and uh, just having a conversation about like uh what are we going to do ahead right like w- what's our plans and all that and it we just ended up talking about so many things and we realized like there are so uh, there are so many things we don't get to discuss in in public or in general at times like with people because people aren't comfortable about it or uh, or rather like they are, they are too hesitant to bring these topics up because it's always just talking about oh have you watched this or have you heard this or you know have you seen this and it's always like uh mainstream stuff pop culture stuff or yeah. uh, at times like n- n- nothing like about you at and it, i think we wanted to do something yeah, right. we can have that kind of a space and like you said like have a space and have a have a have an area where people can just be themselves and make friends for their personalities without like talking about anything yeah. else right yeah. and we, we can be different in so many ways that's that's what we were starting to learn as well that we are we are we are so uh, individual individualistic in our own ways but we also can have like those smallest the smallest of bonds the smallest of like likings and di- likes and dislikes that can kind of make us into a community and make us into a group that like uh, i don't know is there for each other and that bond that gets created just because of like talking about these things and being yourself so uh, really strong like i think this is why with z as well like uh, in such such a short time i was able to become like really close to this guy because i don't know it's just that we we didn't talk about things that uh, that were you know just like uh, shows or all these kind of things just just we we spoke about what was going on with us or rather why uh, or, or what is affecting us in general in our lives and that uh, that just kind of took us to different kinds of discussions in different places and true i think that's what we want to bring out in our community as well Yeah I mean people come together for a bunch of reasons uh, uh, unfortunately the way we are moving towards a more pop culture alignment we we usually get together i mean okay i probably unfortunately was not the right word maybe I mean, just not I, i'm i'm a part of the pop culture alignment <laughs> yeah like i said it's, it's it's not something that i see eye to eye with but if it works for somebody great i mean a lot of people come together they watch the same shows or they go to the same gym or they watch the same kind of movies or they look at the same kind of memes uh well, you stuff know, just have those poppy shirts that will make you like look pop yeah up. like yeah, how yeah, yeah. ask fuck my friend <laughs> 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 people people have those things uh yeah. and that's great but i think that's limiting because um we're still using something external to us to to describe ourselves to somebody yeah. else so if if two people get together because they they watch the big bang theory um it's great but i think it's it's a great first step i think the next step should probably be uh, hey you know what we watch these shows together but i really would love to to uh, tell you things about me that i don't normally talk about and i think that's what communities really power they sort of power people coming in together and bearing their soul really for the lack of a better word and yeah. and we figured that's what we wanted with cheapels 
we wanted people to to i mean okay i mean initially it might start anonymously like a few of you who have been dming us and some comments here and there where Hello? but i think it's a great uh, starting sorry, point sorry sorry uh, i think uh, you like one chunk of it like uh, uh, kind of got cut off you... chunk <laughs> okay uh no the chunk you probably missed out uh is once again saying <laughs> that sheeples is really trying to be a where you can honestly express who you are without any fear of judgment yeah. where yeah. you can you can come and talk about yourself and and not feel shy um because at, at the end of it it's only when we talk to each other that we will realize at some point of how similar we all are and and despite um and despite wanting to be different despite this this innate urge within each of us to just be unique and just be so different uh once we start talking we realize that we are all just we appear disconnected on the surface but deep down we are part of the same land mass uh yeah. we are afraid of the same things we aspire the same things we 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 get happy by similar things and and i i think deep down it's it's this invisible thread that connects all of us uh, and that makes us similar is what empower i don't think a uniqueness empowers uh, empower us because i think that's a little shallow uh, and that's just me i feel that deep down yeah, i think i th- you know what i completely agree with what you say because i i genuinely feel like it is the bonds that we share and the and this might sound sappy my god uh, yeah. people just get me tissues here like you know let's just <laughs> cry it out. but okay. uh, no but i really do think like uh, it's just it's just that those small things that like genuinely make you happy when you talk to someone or when you when you're with uh, with a person that you can really be yourself with and i think that's what a community does for you right like to an extent you you, you can bear yourself out there and not expect to be judged rather like you will have that uh, support and you the other end of it is you when you do something wrong you'll also have people helping you up from that kind of a stage Uh, and that's what that's what the community is here for and that's what we wanted to build with shoopers as well because we want to have that kind of a relationship with not only you shoopers but like with like uh, in real life kind of get you shoopers to kind of have it with other people as well right yeah. within your lives and kind of you know maybe spread that kind of a positive energy positive vibe so that at the end of the day we are not a community that is trying to a brittle or put some other person down but rather uplift each other and help each other achieve our own like particular dreams or goals and yeah i mean we, i think all of us need to have the ability where we acknowledge that some people might think differently and not treat it as a zero sum game i mean uh, just because somebody believes in something is completely the opposite of you doesn't mean the world ends i mean yeah. you can let them have their uh breathing space and i i think one of the the biggest problems with conventional media um especially a lot of social media is the fact that everyone has this instant disapproval i mean you know people just people just let go of somebody else on the first sign of some difference or some rift erupting i mean you know we're just so quick to just uh, cut somebody off and they're like oh okay this guy follows that person oh, okay this guy is from this religion oh, okay this guy has this political affinity and we just block them or we just yeah. mentally uh, and i think that's it's, the problem it's just like what that one thought kind of makes you think like no just because this person likes this or follows this or has this yeah. kind of thought process i will not like listen to their opinions at all no no that shouldn't be the case to be really honest i mean yeah like i mean you can you can do one thing like i mean with sheeples when we started off both of us immediately agreed upon the fact that politics and religions is religion is off the table yeah. um and and both of us probably have similar or probably have very different views but it's okay um, to have certain things that you don't talk about i mean if if you meet somebody in your life who you like nine things out of 10 and that one thing is something that you disagree on it's all right don't talk about it i mean and the other fact is i think within our, our, our discussions as well i don't think like i've had this kind of a topic uh, like broach in general between us right like i i wouldn't i wouldn't say we wanted to really really look into it one of the reasons was because both of us feel like uh, we aren't as uh, 
informed about these topics to really yeah. put our um, two cents I mean yeah we have way. opinions for sure yeah. just like we have our own opinions and quite a few times i think we differ on them which is which we've come to realize as well let's say yeah <laughs> in one of, uh, in some of these things but uh, that doesn't like you know hinder us from talking about 10 different things that we love or don't love and we both can share between each other just because we don't like uh, some topics are uh, off the limits for us doesn't mean there are like other topics we can't talk about right and so, that's that's what that's what we also try to talk about uh, say with uh, other people when when you say like whether they have different opinions or uh, different thought processes in something there are things that make them human uh to uh, and that uh like inherent quality that uh, like they also have between among within themselves that you can connect with and you know what you shouldn't forget about that one part yes like there might be times you might feel they're misguided and there might be times they might feel the same for you but you know what like at least give each other that chance to you know bring those kind of thoughts out rather than completely blocking them away from yeah. each other 